Hey guys, I just got off work. Um, I got off work early today. So now I'm gonna do today what every other normal adult male does on his free time with his dog. I'm gonna go play in the mud. So you can see the creek has gone down a little bit. Before, it was a lot higher than this. So I think we're just gonna walk right along there. We might see some frogs. Who knows what else we might see. There's snapping turtles in here, so I do kind of have to be careful. I got some opening sandals on. See, she's white right now, but she's not gonna be white much longer. Chloe, this way. She's not used to me letting her go in here. Usually when we're walking, she starts to go down here. I'm like, no, just because she gets so muddy. But today is a good day to get muddy. It is really soft. Whoa. Hey. <laughs> Deer tracks. All right guys, I just found a snapping turtle. I just don't want Chloe to get too close because I'll probably bite her. So check this guy out. It's actually a smaller one, but it can still do some damage if you stick your finger in front of his mouth. Alright guys, see that? You never know where a snapping turtle is going to be. You can see its tail wiggling a little bit, but now it's buried underneath there. So you never know, there could be more turtles underneath here. Always watch your step when you're walking through a creek like this. Especially if you have sandals on. One little step and they'll bite your little toe off. But that was definitely pretty cool. I was hoping to see a turtle and see some wildlife, but you never know what you're going to get. But 
I don't want to continue walking. A deer actually just walked by, but the turtle was moving. I didn't want to disturb him. The deer walked right past here. I think he could hear us, but he couldn't see us. You could hear him uh, stomping on the ground and making those grunting noises, like hum, 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 just to kind of let us know he's there and he didn't want us here. But I'm not sure where he went. And I think this is where the geese came down. So I remember kind of up there. I remember these fallen trees. As a kid, we'd clear all this out in certain areas and we'd have forts. We'd be running across here as kids. It was a kid's heaven down here. Me and my cousins would come down here in the summer time and we'd uh, catch frogs and sometimes with our hands, sometimes with nets. But in one summer, we'd catch anywhere between like 30 and 100 frogs. We'd bring them to my grandma and she'd cook them up for us. I remember as kids, the frogs were bigger. I don't know if I'm just older and they seem smaller now, but I remember they used to be like this big and now they seem like they're tiny. It'll probably take like 10 frogs to fill you up now because they're so small. I don't know why they're shrinking, but that's definitely one of my favorite parts of being the kid down here. I was walking through the creek, catching frogs, catching turtles. We didn't eat the turtles, but we ate the frogs. Usually if you walk through here alone, you see a lot more frogs, but because of Chloe, she kind of runs in front of me, so she scares all the frogs away. But I am seeing a few. Usually if you stand back here and look ahead of you, you can see a whole bunch of frogs in there. Of course, she's now she's peeing in the water. That's nice. I don't think I can fit that way. You can tell where all the animals cross a lot. There's a lot of deer tracks in there, raccoons. And it follows right up there. They must walk through here, get some water and then continue walking up there. You can kind of see a path going up there. But I love it out here, it's so peaceful. I could spend hours just walking through here. Looks like it's getting a little deep there. Chloe does not like the deep water. Chloe does not like me going places where she can't go. You guys hear that? Besides my dog, the birds. I love that. I could sit out here for hours. It's a little muddy out here. This is perfect path walking. You don't have to worry about any kind of prickers or thorns. If you get too hot, you can just stick your head under. All right guys, I reached the end. Here's the path back up to my house. Um, I'm gonna give Chloe a little walk to kind of dry her off and get some of that dirt off her. But hopefully you guys are doing well. Happy August. Um, I should have a few more months in the United States, then probably around November, December, or January, I'm gonna take off to the Philippines. I've been looking at tickets, just kind of seeing the prices and seeing the best time to buy them to get a good deal. But I'm super excited for that. So I'll be in the Philippines in a few months, but for now I'm just gonna enjoy my time here. I love it here in the summertime. Days like these are my favorite. But all right, hopefully you guys are doing well. Take care and I'll see you guys next time.